So we have spyings. Somebody spying on you that just wanted to pop up. So we're going to leave it out there. Somebody spying and they jealous already. Holy Spirit, divine, my answers of the highest white light, my spirit guides, my holy angels. Archangel Michael, please protect me and my collective sun seeds where I channel the energies for them. Anything other than the highest white light, close that door. So someone is definitely spying. Someone could definitely be thinking of you, just jealous. Or, you know, somebody could be thinking about how loyal you was when you were um, a part of this person's life. I feel like I'm um, divine feminine, divine masculine. Before I get into this reading, I just feel like you guys have a lot of eyes on you, okay? You are being watched. Um, I'm hearing, well, if you're being watched, then get him something to watch, right? <laughs> but um, this person is definitely crying, Holy Spirit. Give me some more messages from my collective like this message. So we have surprise and breakup. So we have affection. Surprise and breakup. And we have rebound. Happiness under the bottom. Feelings. Love offer. Forgive. Confession. Okay. So someone that you was very genuine with, Sunseeds, okay? Someone who you shared a lot of feelings with. Um, I feel like the feelings was definitely mutual. Someone who you made very happy. Um... I feel like this person definitely, um, somebody cheated. It was some type of deception, Sunseeds. And I feel like you guys found out about it. Um, if you guys didn't get closure, someone is definitely going to be coming towards you forgiveness, for forgiveness. I feel like someone is definitely going to be open. Someone feels like they owe you some type of confession. And when this person confess, I feel like this person is going to tell you everything. But they also want your forgiveness, okay? This person definitely, um, whew, I do see them, um, I see if you've forgiven them, this person wants to give you a love offer. This person, you are this person's happiness. Somebody hooked up with a rebound, okay? Affection and rebound. So somebody hooked up with a rebound, okay? Um, out of lust, you know? So you hooked up with somebody and that's all it was, okay? Every time they see you, it's just like, it, this person's always being reminded of how genuine y'all love was, okay? This person also could feel like that you're very guarded towards their energy right now. Um, you felt like this person had a lot of, kept a lot of secrets from you. You could have seen some type of picture online about this person. And definitely cautious you to pull your energy back. But some type of clarity that you receive, you could have definitely received something online. You could have seen something on your phone. Someone felt like you just stay happily ever after. Somebody definitely, um, somebody hooked up. Somebody became a rebound and it was just sex, okay? I just got to call it like this. It was just, <laughs> it definitely was. Let's pull some cards. Yeah. Somebody was material listed as well. We got bad health, privileged lady, and mean female. Somebody stressed out. Because they could have... Somebody could have chose someone that was very materialistic. Somebody only looked at them for what they can do for them. Maybe this your, the person has a good job. Okay? Some, something appeared good on the outside, but... Um, it wasn't real right. Yeah, somebody also could have lost their job. Somebody could be moving away after realizing they was dealing with this forced person with the community card. This could be someone in the neighborhood, someone around the way. Let's put some more over the camera. Holy Spirit, what's going on with this? Please and thank you. Please and thank you, Holy Spirit. Once that gets unseed. Somebody feels like y'all love was meant to be. I'm sorry, I gotta I'm trying to 
text my son to get up. Somebody feels like y'all love is meant to be. Somebody going to confess to you that they um, wind up hooking up with a rebound, something that was just sexual, um, some uh, some type of lust situation. Somebody can't get over you. Somebody feels like your love is very genuine. You was very passionate towards this um towards this energy. Somebody also sees you as someone very loyal. I feel like this energy is, is in a lot of regret, okay? Ooh. So we have message of concern and we have courtship. I feel like somebody is definitely going to message you, Sun Seeds, um, and confess, um, confess, they're going to confess to you what happened, okay? This person is definitely going through some changes in their life. Someone feels like, um, you know, they they feel like they messed up. They feel like the love was, with you was genuine. Um, somebody wants to start over. Somebody wants to start over. Somebody wants to bring you a love offer. You could be receiving some type of text message email call but this person is going to reach out to you okay and we have the expectation um, in reverse so this person don't know what to expect they honestly don't they just hoping that something didn't end with you guys completely this person is going to try again to give you this you know to see if they could um offer you this love offer after confessing to you about this rebound hoping that you know you will forgive them but they don't they don't at this point they don't with the expectation in reverse they don't know what to expect they're just hoping that it's not over okay yeah we have thief child and lovers concern so somebody could be in concern about regarding um a child okay um somebody definitely was Somebody could have used and abused this person. Somebody realized that they was dealing with a thief. Ooh. I'm hearing pain and pleasure. So whoever this rebound was could have been, um, ooh. Yeah. I feel like the whoever you was dealing with something was, this rebound, um, definitely, um, was not what they expected. I also feel like the person um was afraid of commitment in the past. Okay. Whew. Somebody got shooken up. And now somebody wants to come towards you and make a love offer. Somebody feels like you're the true love. Give me some messages from their person. Oh, who's there? Oh, that car fell all the way over there. Somebody like kissing your lips, son. You are always on my mind. So your person, you are always on your because this person, how this person sees you. This person see someone sees you as your yeah, love is very genuine, okay? But they feel like you're very guarded. This person sees you as their happiness. This person is constantly in their feelings when it comes to you. They're going to come in making a love offer. With this message of concern, I believe it's that love offer, okay? But this is how they're going to come in, okay? Once they confess to you, this person is going to want your forgiveness, okay? Because you are this person wish fulfillment. In their eyes, you are there forever. That's what I'm saying. This person is definitely going to message you, okay? And you are, I feel like the confession is going to be this third party. Whoever this third party that they hooked up with, they're now receiving some type of karma. And it could definitely be in the um, in the abundance. This person could not be doing um, you know, very well financially, okay. But this person is afraid, okay. I feel like this, I feel like this person is afraid. Um, uh, was afraid of commitment, okay. This person was, and I feel like you. For some of you guys, you stood your ground. You set a boundary with this person. You felt like if this person wasn't going to give you what you deserve, then if this was something that you was going to walk away from. And somebody went towards a rebound and hooked up with a rebound for affection and lust, and they got caught up in something. Okay? Somebody don't know what to expect anymore. Somebody got used and abused. That's all I can use and abused. Holy Spirit. These cards are just falling on the floor. So we have destiny is taking us down different paths, but it came up in reverse. So 
maybe in the past, that's why this person went towards a rebound because what I did I just say, I feel like you set up boundaries with this person and you pulled your energy back because you felt like, um, I'm not gonna take it in reverse. You felt like this person, y'all were just on two different pages and you set up boundaries with this person because you felt like, if they wasn't gonna give me what I need, I know my worth, I'm gonna go somewhere else, okay? And this person went to a rebound, something that appeared to look good on the outside, and now got themselves caught up in a situation, but they can't stop spying on you because you're always on their mind. This person is gonna message you and tell you how they feel. For some of you guys, I believe that you guys are gonna receive a message of this person pouring their heart out, letting you know how, how, much, you, how much you mean to them. They don't know what to expect from this conversation or after they confess, but they're hoping that they can have your forgiveness because they don't want something to end. A lot of you guys, this could be a, um, someone at a, um, could be a long distance relationship or someone at a distance from you. I can't make it up. Long distance. And it says, I gave into temptation. Thank you, Holy Spirit. This person gave into temptation. This person checked on you from afar. I have sexual fantasies about you. Mm. I feel like this person abandoned, you know, abandoned you, okay? Made you feel like you weren't good enough and, and hooked up with a rebound. All because I feel like somebody just wanted more from the relationship. Someone expected more. Somebody expected this to be there forever. And someone hooked up with a rebound. And it kind of, it hurt, it hurt you. It hurt you. It made you feel like what you guys had, it wasn't real. It wasn't genuine. But somebody definitely receives karma for hooking up for whoever the third party is. Believe me when I say, son, sees karma done got this person for whoever that third party was that they um hooked up with. I feel like I'm not good enough for you. This person feels like they're not good enough for you. Yeah, some of them feel like you deserve better than them. This person misses you. Secrets and deception. You make them want to be a better person. Please forgive me. You have, please forgive me. Okay, I'm telling you. Let me get the other card. Because I have, yeah. This person wants your forgiveness. This person wants your forgiveness. Yeah, what I say, they reminiscing. Someone hoping that you'll be patient with them. This person loves you. This person loves you. Okay? I feel like even when they hooked up um, with that rebound, they still loved you. They just... They, they knew you required more. And somebody this is somebody that it was scared of commitment. Wow. I feel empty without you. This person feels very empty without you. You are this person with fulfillment. I feel like they, they, they thought. I feel like a lot of things haunt this person as well. Yeah. Somebody feels like... um. You know, you're someone who's, you know, have a beautiful house, very abundant, very, um, you know, great fortune, you know, and somebody else is definitely in spiritual jail receiving karma and it's hitting their pockets with the poverty. Somebody is definitely receiving karma for the most high for what they did to you. This person could um, feel like they constantly, constantly working hard and they're, they're not making ends meet. They still coming up empty handed. This person could be thinking about ways of how they, um, to bring in more money, but it's hard for this person. Okay. Yeah, this person sees you mm -hmm, being someone of, of high honor, um, receiving a lot of wealth, unexpected income. Yeah, somebody just somebody hooked up with a thief. Yeah, and now they in despair about it. Somebody is definitely whoever this per your person is. Sun seeds. Um, this and this person is receiving karma. Okay, but they're going to message you, um, begging for your forgiveness, wanting you know, wanting to confess. Um, everything I'm hearing. This person is going to tell you about the third party. Um, they also might tell you about financial problems that they have and how they're looking for a job or how they, uh, if this person still currently have a job, they could be saying, you know, I'm working a lot of hours or I'm working overtime and I still don't feel like thing, you know, um, I still don't feel like, um, I'm making ends meet. We have the journey, mature man and change, but I feel like this journey, mature man and change, um, Things are definitely ending out um, this person's life. It is. Someone is being forced to go within and grow up. And you know what, you know, um, what wisdom and, and, and um, you know, becoming wise. Because this man got a lot of gray on him. A lot of gray. 
you know, either he an older man or he just someone that has a lot of, you know, um, aging very quickly. Thank you, spirit. Um, and wisdom come with a lot of mistakes. Okay. So someone definitely is learning from their mistakes. Okay. This person definitely could be um, moving away. Or just going on. Somebody could definitely be going on some type of spiritual journey. Going within. I feel like you definitely inspire this person. To want to change. This person also. Um, this person could be also nobody receiving karma. Because of what they've done to you. Thank you spirit. Yeah. Wealthy man. Efficient person. Mature. I mean privileged lady. Yeah. Many male, many female. Ooh. Somebody that was um somebody that was guided to make this relationship work with you. They was guided to make this right. They was guided to stay with this person. Yeah. They was guided to, you know, make things right. But this is somebody that's scared of um commitment. Maybe you may uh be more wise than this person. Even if you guys are the same age or you could might be a little older. Um, I'm not sure. Take it how it resonates. M could be very significant. M. Um, M or J could be very significant. But maybe you more um, mature than this person. Because obviously this person was very immature. Scared of commitment. Then hooked up with a rebound. And they receiving karma. Because they wasn't mature enough to make a wise decision. This person was guided to um, work things out. This person could have definitely went to a younger energy. Okay. Um, this person was definitely materialistic. But I feel like with the official person and a wealthy man. This person definitely could have had some type of stain. Some type of name in the neighborhood. And felt like they had it like that. And they hooked up with somebody who appeared to look good on the outside but this person only wanted them for their money hmm. somebody has a um is being hit with a lot of legal fees as well you could be dealing with somebody in the law enforcement this person could be a correction officer could do um work at some type of um law enforcement could be a cop Somebody is receiving some. Somebody is. This person definitely could have gotten pulled over too. Somebody's losing a lot of money. They're not making the same money that they had because they ignored the guidance from spirit. And now this person is being journey mature me to change. Do this journey mature me to change. Now this person is being forced by the divine to work on themselves. They're being forced to go within. They're being forced to release things that no longer serve them. They're being forced to go through these changes to close out cycles because of what their main female and their main female, main male with a mature woman. I feel like somebody was guided, was being guided to work on something with somebody that was mature. Okay. But they they was intimidated by you. Uh, that's what I'm getting. They was intimidated by you. Now they being forced to go within and grow up. And grow up. They being forced. Because somebody didn't want to listen. So spirit let like this person hook up. Because look at this. We have the main male, main female, and mature woman. Somebody left you behind, and I feel like they left you behind to go towards someone that was a younger, you know, younger, um, um, didn't require much of them, okay? Somebody, I heard inexperienced, but they didn't know whoever this younger person was. They wanted their finances. They wanted money. They was just as materialistic, as immature as they were. Now somebody's being forced to go with them. Because you have wealthy man, official person, message, and privileged lady. This person could definitely be dealing with a lot of legal issues. Okay? They don't have what they used to have. They could be trying to, yeah. Somebody could be trying to um figure out ways how to bring in money. They definitely could be looking for job, work. Yeah, but something is coming to an end. This somebody that um, that looks at the outer sides, 
the, look at the um the outer, okay? And that's how they judge people. Somebody has made a, a somebody is being forced to go with it, okay? And now they want to come to you. Now they want to offer you this commitment. But this rebound situation definitely forced this person to go with them. Yeah, they spy on you. They watch you a lot. This was somebody that felt like, you know, you, you, you always express your love to this person and it was just like, it wasn't enough. It wasn't, it wasn't enough. This person was like, what love got to do with it? I'm looking for something I can have fun with. And you was looking for something more stable. Yeah, you was looking for something more stable. Yeah. I feel like you decided to leave somebody who was attached to some type of addiction. Something that, things that was unhealthy. And you took a leap of faith on yourself. You took a risk. And you started setting up boundaries when it came to this person. This person was somebody that was definitely afraid of commitment. Holy Spirit, give me some messages from my connected company. This was somebody that likes to party a lot. I heard hat. Somebody could wear a lot of hats. Yeah, we had the sun card, first card out. With the seven of swords, five of pentacles. Ooh, five of pen seven of swords, five of pentacles, four of swords. Yeah, nine of wands. I feel like you guys are the wounded warrior. You guys definitely um, faced a lot of challenges and been through a lot, okay? I definitely, you know, see you. I see you putting a lot, you know, putting things to rest that no longer serve you after receiving clarity. Someone definitely, um, I do see you leaving someone out in the cold and rejecting them because you felt like this person was sneaky. They was a liar. Okay. This is somebody that want to play victim. Okay. And you just like, no. So a lot of you guys, you are going to hear this person out. But the moment that you play victim, it's like, it's over. You're not going to deal with it. I do see you healing from the situation. I do see you being happy. You know, I'm having a lot of success and abundant. I do see you moving on and, and you know, moving on. And I'm hearing for, to the light, the light, moving on. And look what, look, what, look what pop out. Empress, I do see you moving on, being happy, healing, being abundant after dealing with that energy. Divine feminine. You know that there's no gender in tarot. Divine feminine, divine masculine, but divine feminine is out here. Okay? This is a beautiful, beautiful energy. Beautiful. Okay? And this person is saying, you're always on a mind. How could you not be? Okay? For a lot of you guys, I'm getting this person hit they they um they true self from you, son seeds. They hit their true self. They spying. This person hit them true, they true selves from you. Yeah, we had the King of Wands with the Knight of Swords. Somebody is definitely coming in quick to take some type of action. Yeah. Queen of Pentacles is with the Seven of Cups. This person definitely had a lot of options. Okay? They could have had an option between you, Empress, with the Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Somebody was definitely looking for attention. And they got the, they was a six of one, I'm telling you. Somebody was looking for attention. This person was looking for attention. And you wasn't going to give them that anymore, Empress. You know your worth. You wasn't going to give them that anymore. Okay? You wanted something that was going to be stable. And you you felt like you guys were just on two different pages in life. So I'm going to go the other way. 
But whoever you was dealing with at the time, this person was a attention seeker. You want you you pulled your attention back. So the moment you pull your attention back, this person automatically, because they was immature, they felt like, oh, you pulled your energy back. Either you're dealing with somebody else or you don't want them no more. There's somebody that has to have attention. And the moment that they don't get attention, they don't feel validated. So this person went to an energy which was this rebound and affection for lust. Because they have to have attention. Seven of Cups, Queen of Pentacles, and the Six of Wands. This is somebody that needs attention. Okay? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, energy. Somebody needs attention and who has options. But look, that attention got them ten swords in their back. They got betrayed. Somebody got betrayed. They have no choice but to go within and start over. Anything after the ten is the one. Spirit is forcing this person to go on this journey to mature, to change. Okay? Spirit is forcing this person to go within. I'm telling you, six of swords. Spirit is forcing this person to go within. I can't I can't come through on the spirit. I'm telling you, I can't make it up. Spirit is forcing this person to move away from these toxic addictions. Whatever, whatever attachment that they have to let it go. They're being guided to move away. And I feel like for some of you guys, you was guided to move away from this person as well. With the hermit and the world card. This spirit guy told you to close out a cycle. Somebody was somebody was toxic. They was a liar. They was sneaky. This person liked the attention. Yeah. Six of swords with the four swords. Put something to rest. You are always, you being guided by spirit. Yeah. The star card. Put something to rest and heal. And that's what you did, Empress. And somebody's in regret. Because they see you as so, your love was so genuine. You were so loyal. Somebody want to know, how can we start over? This person is coming in quick. This person is coming in quick. Whoever this person that had options in the past, they ain't got options no more. They coming in quick. Give me a card on the King of Wands with the Knight of Swords, Holy Spirit. Thank you. Yeah, we had the Moon card and the Queen of Swords. They coming in quick, but for some of you guys, I feel like you're gonna um, you're gonna cut this person out because you you because of the secrets that they had. This person had too many secrets. It was too much, too many secrets and deception. Okay, it was. Yeah, the Hermit and a Temperance card. Mm. I feel like I'm t someone is chosen. Someone is an Earth Angel. Someone has a, a, a strong spirit guy. Your, your spirit guys don't play about your team. Your team is strong. Your team is strong. Your team done, done gave you some type of download about whoever this. <coughs> excuse me. Whoever about this deception that was going on. Somebody works very closely with the most high, with the divine. Someone is very, very enlightened. Very enlightened. I'm hearing before they time. You can't get over. They cannot get over on you. They cannot. Eight of Wands, this person is going to communicate. I'm telling you, they're going to communicate. Eight of Wands with the Three of Pentacles. This person is going to communicate with you and, and, and uh, about um, how they want to work with you. This person want to work with you, okay? This person is now enlightened. This person is now enlightened, okay, about this connection and what you mean to them, okay? This person went through something. I'm telling you, Two of Cups. Oh, they enlightened about what this connection means to them. Somebody see you like like from a different galaxy. Like somebody feels like I, I can't even fumble the words how somebody sees you, Sunseed. Somebody is addicted to your energy. Somebody, um, this player, whoever this player you dealt with, oh, they being forced to do it. Somebody, 
Somebody know that they receive a karma because of you. You are spoiled by the divine. You work very closely with the divine. Very closely with the divine. For a lot of you guys, you were married to this person or just in a commitment with this person for a long time. And you guys had set up boundaries and you know, and said things that you wasn't going to accept. Okay, after finding out about secrets and deception, you say, I'm not going to accept that. And if this is what you want to continue to do, then maybe we just on two different pages. Somebody went within and healed themselves. Somebody else went to a rebound. But they didn't know who the rebound they went to. They had options just like them. Give me a card on the moon, Holy Spirit. I feel like you ain't got... <sighs> wow. I'm hearing, oh, what? I heard you, I heard, I just heard you flex without even trying, sun seeds. Somebody was doing the most. Somebody was materialistic. I heard you flex without even trying. Wow. Let's get these cards that fell on the floor. Somebody is receiving karma. Somebody is receiving karma. They feeling like a damn fool. They feeling like a fool. Somebody feels like a fool. Okay? They do. For whatever decision that they made, somebody feels like a fool. Ace of Swords under the bottom. Spirit said that's a damn truth. I'm going to leave this reading here. Okay? Let me clarify the Ten of Swords. Holy Spirit, clarify the Ten of Swords. The world card. What did I say? Anything after the 10 is the one. A cycle is over. Yes, spirit guys. It's like. <laughs> yeah, somebody here. Five of cups. Five of swords. This person is definitely going through major changes. Okay. They're getting left behind. People around them are walking away. People are turning their back on them. People don't want to deal with this person. Everything how this person made you feel, they are now feeling. Let me get you guys some um, guided uh, messages from your um, spirit guys before we close this out. Yeah, I told you something. This person is going to come back and want to apologize. Page of cups. Okay? Eight of, eight of um, cups after walking away from you. This person, when this person walked away, they still would have love for you. They still loved you. But they, they just were scared of commitment. I feel like you guys are very mature for your age. More mature than this person. And this person wanted to be in this childlike act of running around like a, a kid. But somebody was forced to grow up. They was. Somebody went from a knight to the king. They was forced. And they had a head about it. Eight of swords. Holy Spirit, give me some messages from my collective son. See, this person spies and watches you. A lot. But I, somebody is somebody is receiving karma. Magical getaway. I feel like this is you. Look at this. Look at this energy. Somebody sees you as the magical getaway. Thank you, spirit. Wow. Because I just said earlier, it's like I can't fumble the words that spirit is trying to give me. Like this energy, it just, it's like magnetic. Like it's just magical. It's just magical. Somebody was blind not to see this. Look at this. You are the magical getaway. Somebody want to escape with you. It's like you're so magical. I can't, that's what I said earlier. I couldn't fumble the words. It's like your energy, who you are, is just so unbelievable. What, what this person sees when they see you is what they see on TV, not in real life. You're like a magical getaway. Somebody wants to escape with you. I can't make it up because you shine from within. I couldn't explain it. And I don't know, it making me emotional a little bit. Maybe it's this person's energy I'm picking up on. You sh I can't follow the words earlier, how this person sees you. And maybe that's why I can't get the words out because that's how they feel. It's like they can't explain it. They can't explain it. But they know they want it. They know they want it. This person sees you as a magical getaway. Somebody feels like you're very beautiful. Your light shines from within. Somebody feels like you're very inspirational with this inspiration. 
wish wisely. I feel like you're somebody who who's very wise. You're very intuitive as well. Healing. Somebody, I can't make it up. Look at this healing. With this rainbow. I said I couldn't get the words out. And Spirit is saying, I'm going to get it out for you. Thank you, Holy Spirit. <laughs> what did I say, son? See, just look at this. I said, I can't fumble the words. Okay, how this person sees you. Okay? Because this is a beautiful energy. But Spirit said, I'm going I'm to I'm give you the words. Magical getaway. This person sees you as magical. You shine from within. Inspiration. For me, very, this person feels like you're very inspirational. Wise, wisely. I mean, wish wisely. Somebody feels like you're a powerful manifester. You're very highly intuitive. Okay? Someone sees you as someone very sparkly and spoil you by the most high. Somebody sees you as a healer. Transformation. Solitude. I feel like when this person hurt you and went to a rebound, you went within. You didn't go to another relationship. You didn't pour your pain onto someone else. That's what happened with this person. Somebody worked on themselves. Somebody has a lot of wisdom. You could be seeing owls, but somebody believes in magic. And they know the power that they have within them. For a lot of you guys, you guys are fairies. Like, you guys are... For some of you guys, you bring karma to people's life, whether that's good or bad. When people hurt you and people mistreat you, they receive karma instantly, immediately. You force people, yeah. People have no choice. When they, they, this person is going through a transformation for what they did to you. They go on through it. For a lot of you guys, you guys like mermaids, fairies. You guys could have had someone who went at a young age some type of spirit guy or a fairy that you probably always had like imaginary friend, someone you talk to. You guys could definitely follow the stars and the moons since a young age. Someone could be an astrologist. Somebody definitely follows the moon. Somebody likes playing in nature. Someone is the need. Someone is nature. Oh, wow. Thank you, spirit. Someone is nature. That's powerful. But you've been special since a kid. <laughs> since a kid. What did I say? Look at this baby girl. Very motivational. And I said, yeah. Someone likes to follow the moon. The stars. Moon energy. Wow. New beginnings. That is beautiful. I love you, Sun C, so very much. Until we get next time. I love you, Sun C. This person is spying and they're watching you. Someone is definitely watching. They come and torch you. Person is being forced by the divine to go with and go through this transformation. Yeah. I feel like you are a pupil karma, whether it's good or bad. Somebody is, somebody, whew, messing with you would not be a good sign. I'll let you know, that's why intention is everything. But you don't know people's intentions. Divine know people's intentions. So, you know, some people, you know, this you good, good, you know, just reading energy, you know, like myself. But um, somebody is not to be messed with at all.